Hey guys, it's Adam here, your Northern Tech, and today we're going to do a video on how to render for YouTube using Windows Movie Maker. Alright guys, let's do this. Okay, so as you all notice here, I got Windows Movie Maker open. This is the brand new 2012. I just downloaded it, just installed it, just for this video. Okay, so what we're going to need to do is first get a clip going, which we have here. Look, you can tell it's my old Grand Theft Auto 5 PlayStation 3 unboxing video uh, when I bought the PlayStation 3, I believe, last month. Anyway, what we're going to go ahead and do is, first thing you want to do is go over here to Save Movie. I've already created the template, but I'm going to show you how to do it. You're going to come down here to Create Custom Setting. We are going to basically click on Name, type in whatever the frig we want. I always have it set to 1280 by 720. That gives me a 720 high definition display or video I should say. You can set it to 1920 by 1080 to give you that 1080p if you want it. I honestly could care less. Now the bit rate set to 8,000 kilobits kind of high don't you think? I always run it at 4,000. Frame rate 29.97 good enough for me but then I come down here to the audio and pin that at 1920 by uh, by 48 kilohertz stereo just so it sounds extra crisp and we click save call it whatever the frig we want we'll go ahead and close this then to save the movie you are not going to click on here you are going to click on save movie the bottom portion you're gonna click on whatever the frig we want or whatever you called your template it's gonna bring this up we're gonna put it in the video directory we are not going to make it an mp4 we are going to make it a windows media video file and we're going to call it my movie go ahead and click save sit back and relax let this render out now it's going pretty quick on my rig keep in mind guys this is only a one minute and 12 second video and this computer is a second generation i7 2600 running at 3.4 gigahertz on four cores Four cores with dual threads simulating an eight core system. So we're going to go ahead and let this here crunch itself out. It's coming along nicely. Oh yeah, just nicely. Look at it go. Skeetily douche. Okay, so let's going to say do you want to open the directory where the video is? Yes, we do. There's the video. MyMovie.WindowsMedia video. Go ahead and we're going to open up Google Chrome here. Oh, something failed. Uh, we're going to go to Add More Movies. We're going to go to the video directory. We are going to find our Windows Media video. We are going to click open. We are going to let that upload. And theoretically, we should not get the famous error of shit's dicked, do not want to upload. Better render it in a different format or else I'm going to take forever to do my thing. I'm going to go ahead and save the file. Make sure it's set to private because I do not want this going live. And we'll see if we get that error message. We shouldn't get that error message. I've tested this before and it worked fine, but we will see. Already at 45%, still no message. We're still doing good, people. Sitting at 60% on the uh, timer, still no message. Very good sign. Eighty-five percent. Still no message saying that it's not set up for streaming. This is working out really, really well. I am really impressed with this. I've tried this before and it worked fine. I played with this trying to see if it was possible. And so far, it looks like it's going to work. So that took about four minutes to upload and it made it. We're not getting the error message and it should start processing right away. Look at that. Look at how quickly that processed. Boom, 95% done. Video should be live in T minus five, four. Oh, video's live, done like dinner. So if we go ahead and click on the link, it'll load up the video. Alrighty guys, welcome to Scaving Games. Today and we're doing there a you go. That I normally don't do on this, this channel. It's a different style. So, there you have it, people. Uh, that's how you would upload 
or edit using Windows Movie Maker, make sure it's in WMV format. If you make it MP4, basically YouTube is gonna come back with that error message. If it's in Windows Media Video, then it'll work. So hopefully you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, leave a, leave a like button press, give that old like button a clickety clack. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, leave them below. Any other tutorial requests, leave them below. And until next time guys, peace the frig out.